Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Hello guys, welcome to the Dara Education Project video tutorial series for the jQuery. And in this session number 20, we are going to explain uh, uh, how to change the color of one selector with the help of clicking uh, the button. And so for this, we are going to create a new PHP file. And uh, first of all, we need to save it with the name of uh, but click button change example okay now we have a code here change css example change css example something like this and first of all we need to add the script here script type is equal to javascript and the source is equal to jquery and after that i am just adding uh, h1 uh, change change of css okay we are not closing the script tag here and after that i am just adding input type is equal to button and name is equal to change design something like this these small steps will help you to make a larger picture of the any animation or something else i'm just creating a paragraph tag here the the color of the background and foreground of this paragraph will be changed when we will press the button here button okay now we save this one and after this we need to add a okay we are not going okay we have some mistakes here we are not closing h1 here and now we are going to add a script type is equal to javascript and uh, after that we are running the whole program in it okay since we always know uh, all know that uh, that dollar sign is the first uh, thing we have to perform in the jquery and after that i'm using the button here button and inverted single inverted comma dot click handler click handler this one with a click handle and after this i'm i want to change the background color of the paragraph so i'm using dollar sign inverted p and dot css and here i will use a background and the background color change the color of the background something like uh, this one and if i want to change some more css spec colors and that this time i want to change the color of the foreground and i want to change the color of the foreground it's something something like whatever you want and in my e-commerce now we will run this program in our google chrome and uh, here is the program okay we are not uh, giving any value to the button that's why our button is not short of everything and uh, i think it will change and the value it will be very useful to remember that if you use uh, one single inverted comma then you can only close it with the single comma here change look something like now we will refresh this page no well okay now you can see that this look was uh, changed when we click the uh, paragraph button here and if uh, we want to change the something else mm, something like this and something like change the color not this one okay similarly use another property dot css font 
family and use the uh, impact one here okay now we will refresh this page and see what happened okay this is the original one and now you can change and the change of the whole paragraph or even the program or even the whole website can be changed with only just one click so thank you very much for watching this tutorial and allow